Hello everybody, it's Sephiroth 204 for the finale to Luigi's Mansion 3DS. In the last episode, we took on the final portrait uh, ghosts, including Vincent Van Gogh, the ghost that uh, started everything, and uh, got our last boo, got our, <laughs> got our treasure for that, and now we are going to... Go rescue Mario from this door that has explosive ghost mice on it. I like this, uh... So if you try to go through this hallway uh, without enough booze, which I think might be 40, I think that's like the thing. I don't know, it pushes you out. I probably should have shown that, but eh. But anyway, final door time. The spade door. Fancy. So don't just go rushing into this room. There's a few things that you can do. First of all, there's a uh, sapphire you can get out of the chandelier there. I think you can leave the room and go save if you really want to. Yeah, there's money that comes out of here. It's very sneaky for them to do this. Like, who would think? Who would think that the final room that has, like, a trigger point would do this? But yeah. Okay. Let me just look around for a second. So there's a mirror if you really want to get out of here. I don't know who that is. What in the world is this? Probably Mario. And uh, yeah, that's where we were before. You can even see the ladder back there. But let's go. Ah, I could just stare at my Mario painting for hours. It's true what they say about fine art. It takes utterly refined sensibilities to truly appreciate it. The way you plead for help, Mario, you find it so satisfying. Perhaps that is merely because I remember how much trouble you've caused me in the past. Seriously though, who would actually believe that mansion's gonna give it away in contests? Talk about stupid! What do they feed you, Mario Brothers, anyway? Gullible soup? Your brother came all this way just to get turned into a painting. It's just terrific. However, <laughs> this Mario painting looks lonely. I must have a Luigi painting as well. Then my gallery will truly be complete. <laughs> I'm not afraid of you, fool. I fear only that infernal Poltergust 3000 you carry in your back, stupid machine. But I am a king among boos. I swear it, I shall fear no mere house cleaning device. I must say, I despise the way you <laughs> vacuumed up all my friends. Don't imagine that I'll flee. I'll fight you like a true boo. Now join your brother inside that painting. <laughs> Uh oh. And prepare yourselves. For final boss time, against Bowser and King Boo. And this fight is creepy as all heck, and you'll see why <laughs> soon. But man, it's so creepy. Once again, this follows the rules, the same rules of uh, previous boss fights. Don't get hurt. Unfortunately, getting hurt is really easy, so we're just not going to listen to that. Right, you have to shoot it into his face, I forgot. Look. And he's already destroying the things that give us health back, so that's good. Hello. He 
Okay, so you shoot his head off. Yeah! And King Boo comes out. And then you try to suck him up. While Bowser shoots you. That actually was pretty good. Okay, head goes on forward, which means we're doing another regular round of action. Uh oh. I like the like the background music kind of has like Oh, come on. You know, like the the Bowser vibes in it. I don't know why I couldn't I couldn't get a, a grip on that uh, spike ball there. That was annoying. I was really planning on doing well. <laughs> Uh -oh. Come on, it's exploding around your head. Just, to, just accept it. See, I, I have a fear. Yep, that if I walk into it, it's just gonna do that. Okay, okay, we're going for bronze. Going for bronze. Don't let him eat you, by the way. Yeah, I don't, I don't get it. I don't know. That should have worked, and I, I, I'm actually kind of upset. <laughs> I'm actually kind of upset. Okay, all right. So Bowser ate us, and it does 20 damage. Follows it up with fire. So I'm probably going to die, is what I'm getting. Ah, oh, this is so lousy. I really didn't want to get a bronze on Bowser. Oh, come on! I didn't touch that. I kind of want to take the death. I, I really kind of want to take the death. I mean, I died in my original Let's Play, so, you know, it would be consistent. Can't believe I didn't actually get eaten there. Game? So now his head's gonna go on upside down, and he's gonna go on a rampage. Just gonna kind of not hit anything. Okay. Apparently he's being a good, a good, well-behaved boy today. Okay. Okay. I'm. Okay, alright. I'm going to die, and it's not my fault. It's this game's fault. It's this is entirely the game right now screwing up. <sighs> That's so horrifying. Come here. Come here. Now I want you to run at me. Yeah. Nope. I'm just gonna have him destroy the rest of these. So I can get health. Because I'm cheap like that. Come on. Come at me. Got three of these, Bowser. You two chicken to ro oh god, I forgot he jumps. I forgot he jumps. Come here. Be a good boy. Mm. 
No, nothing in there. <laughs> oh, this is the worst. I'm so sorry that this is just a stupid fight. This is so stupid. I kind of love it too. Oh, come on. Really? There was a poison mushroom in that one also? Oh well. Alright. Let's do this. Yeah, I see you behind me this time. Anyway, that's it. Uh, we get his crown. And Bowser is beheaded and dies again. That was that was probably the worst fight I've had with him, but maybe by getting our health back we'll have a silver? Let's see. Because we had 52. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what the uh, the criteria for silver is. You did it truly remarkable, my boy. I supplied the Pulse Ghost 3000, but you ran with all the way to the top, sir. So. <laughs> Baby, so proud. <laughs> Get a hold of yourself, cat. What's that? You found King Boo. He jumped into a pentagon Bowser, you say? He even flew blue fire at you? Well, well, in all my years of ghost research, I've never heard such a fantastical tale. And that career spends 60 years, mind you. Why, I still recall starting out as a young whelp who trembled at the mere thought of a ghost. Trembled, I say! Oh, beg your pardon, this old brain goes recollecting every now and then. Oh, goes recollecting every now and then. I could sit down and feel the weeks spinning ghost yarns. Why, just last. Uh, right, anywho, Luigi, grab your brother's painting and bring him to the lab. <laughs> Poor little fellow has fallen asleep. He must have collapsed with relief and exhaustion when he saw you arrive. I'll get the machine ready to return your brother to his former state, alrighty? I'll be expecting you both. Hmm. By the way, we're in the secret altar. <laughs> oh, he's so excited. Look at that smile. This a mess with your head. All your hard work lasted only a single night. Well done, Luigi. I mean, yeah, I've been doing this over the course of an afternoon, so I started at like um two, maybe, and it's seven thirty now. Mention those booze built disappeared in tonight. Well, well, I don't know. Maybe it was early than two. Maybe it was like one or something. No, it can't, couldn't have been one because I got home. It was probably around two. Anyway, that treasure seems to be real. I have no interest in such stuff. So go on and keep it all. Use it however you like. Say what? Enough rattling on about money. I guess you better get your brother back then. Of course your brother's really important, but first we have to take care of these last ghosts. <laughs> I like that uh, Boo and Bowser's head have their like own thing and not just like the wisps from the previous times that we did that. Ghosts are invisible, so we need to press them into. Yeah, bronze, visible forms. Silver on Jarvis. Bronze on Soupy. Silver on. Who is that? It's Grimsley. Oh, Sir Weston, probably. Uh, Clockwork Soldiers have got a silver, apparently. That stinks. Oh, there's Sir Weston. So... Oh, it was Van Gore, right. I'd be jealous of donuts and nobody but me has such a lovely, such lovely paintings. Okay, so Grimley was the only gold that we got this time around? Or this, uh, area? Yeah, there's Van Gore. Sure enough, it's a silver. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, I think my hands were just tired or something. That's part of the reason why the game sucked. Also, the circle pad. <laughs> Playtime. One hour, seven minutes, apparently. That's that's a nice amount better than uh, my other save file. 
That 20 million is just from those, uh, speedy spirits I searched for during the blackout. Also, it doesn't show it here, but Boo's crown, King Boo's crown is worth, like, a thousand or something. It's like nothing. It didn't even tally it there. <laughs> But anyway, let's let's end this. You just gotta put it in reverse. I love the music for this. They improved that scene from the original. <laughs> yeah, they added a lot of. They added a lot of sound, like um, sounds, voices. I love it. I love this game so much. I love the ending. Oh man, I forgot the credit music is so good. Anyway, yeah, that's uh, Luigi's Mansion 3DS. I already gave a, uh, a review on the original in the original, so this review is just going to be on the changes. Um, the music is the same. Uh, however, one thing I would like to note with changing, uh, that I have noted, is that they added a lot of sound effects in this game. They added voices, they added, uh, sounds to the characters, they added ghosts making music, uh, making sounds, like their, their sounds outside of the room, so you can hear it from the hallway, and it kinda, like, brings you into the fact that the ghosts are not, like, in their own separate environments, like, it's, it's one castle, so, like, they, that's an improvement. Sound definitely improved. Uh, although, like, some of the bass is not as bassy, the GameCube is just better at that. Um, but yeah. Controls. Ooh. <laughs> I think this game is harder than the GameCube version. <laughs> Thank you, Luigi Rap. I think this game is harder than the original. Uh, I think the circle pad is not meant for a game like this, and I'm seriously, like, worried that I'm gonna break my 3DS just normally using it with this game. Um, that being said, some of the features are okay, like, having the motion controls is a lot- is a little nicer for, like, you know, that area where you had to shoot the moon, if you can get it right with the motion controls. Um, it has the potential to be precise, but you really have to be used to it, and it's... Like, playing it from... going from the original to this game, the controls are definitely harder. Uh, I don't really like it. <laughs> uh, Graphic-wise, it's quite an improvement. Um, everything is sharper. The 3D is really good. Like, really good. Um, and there's just... everything is detailed that, like, was kinda not <laughs> detailed before. So, yeah, it's really good there. And story's the same. I still haven't tried out Guiji, but, um, yeah. And so the matter of the ghost was settled. Professor Egad was so delighted to have all of his paintings return that he used the treasure Luigi had found to build Luigi a new house. Nice. Congratulations, your mansion is complete. Wow. Hey. Yay. The end. Now, like I said, I think there's an S rank mansion now, but uh, I don't. I think you need like 150 million or something. I don't know. Maybe 120. <laughs> Maybe I like just missed it. Uh, but yeah, so that's. I think everything else is pretty much covered. The just the game itself is, is fantastic. I still give it like a 8 or a 9 out of 10. I don't even know what I... Have you had the chance to do what I asked, Luigi? Let's take a look. No, I didn't use him because I don't have a friend. 
Yeah, when you got a chance, I'd like you to take Guiji. I'll leave Guiji. Okay, so I don't know. It seems like there's something extra that you get for for beating this with the with co-op. I just have no idea. Super, it's <laughs> super rich. Okay. Uh, yeah, but uh, that's going to do it for this Let's Play. Bow. And, uh, yeah, so I, I highly recommend this game. If you don't have a GameCube, can't play the original, play this version. It's definitely good. Um, just, you know, give the controls a, a little time. Uh, but yeah, so, like, I would give this... I don't, know, I don't know what I gave the original. I probably gave it, like, a 9 or a 9.5 because... I love this game. I love this game so much. I love the fact that you can play it in an afternoon. Like, I love it. Um, fine. It's getting a 9.5 now because I love it. I wouldn't put it at a 10 because, again, the controls are annoying sometimes. But yeah, thank you very much for watching, and uh, see you guys another time. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye. Hmm.